It's been a difficult past couple of years as Central Ohio deals with the pandemic. And while this virus has taken its toll on our economy, some communities are pushing forward and creating development that defies this economic slowdown. Now, all week long, 10TV is partnering with this week's community news to show you what's new in 2022. Today, we head over to Grandview Heights. 10TV's Tina Ramos shows us a little corner that the city considers a cornerstone of its economic future. Grandview Heights has always been known as a community with a small town feel. But something big is happening. We have gone through tremendous change in the last 15, 20 years. Mayor Greta Kearns is excited to bring in the next phase of this developing community. It's called Grandview Crossing. It's about 55 plus acres total. About a third of that is in the Grandview side. And it's a multi-use, modern, very forward-thinking vision. This is a site that was once contaminated. But through that forward-thinking vision, the site now has a purpose. Look at these drawings, new apartments, retail, and an attraction that means more tax dollars to the community. 625,000 in property taxes, 400,000 of which will go to Grandview Heights schools. But there's much more. You see, the design was intentional considering how small Grandview Heights is. Grandview Heights, 1.3 miles, you can walk anywhere in 20 minutes here. And so that this was intentionally planned to be walkable. And it's that small town feel that welcomes an economic boost on a little corner of town. So this is a tremendous opportunity for us and it's really a perfect fit with our planning. That is bringing about big potential. In Grandview Heights, Tino Ramos, 10 TV News. Now, there are also changes coming to Gahanna Lincoln High School. According to our partners at This Week Community News, the new stadium is expected to be done by the end of the 2024 school year. This is the final design approved by the Gahanna School Board. The project has an expected cost of $158 million. This new design would move the stadium east of the current spot. And remember, you can find all these stories and much more on our website. Just head over to 10TV.com.